so today I thought, oh, it would be really fun to go to this nice big park, lots of wide open spaces with a playground, um, and just let the kids run around and play. And so I read about one of these places in my book. It's called um, the, the Prater. Okay, well, we got here. <laughs> And it is not a park, but a massive theme amusement park. theme park. Totally awesome! Not at all was I, what I was expecting. So we're kind of walking through it. I don't know if we'll actually do anything, um, but it's definitely interesting. It's free entry to walk through. I think you just pay for each of the rides individually, but... Um, yeah, we came to Vienna's amusement park today, apparently. Just goes to show you can't trust what you always read in the guidebooks. What we call a bit of a fail. <laughs> so we went to Prater Park, which was an amusement park, not a beautiful grassy area for children to run around. And then I looked up in my book that Danube Island, in the middle of the Danube River that runs right by Vienna, um, that there are um, great swimming spots. And so we took the kids to Danube Island. There are not great swimming spots. There are um, like little, what would you call them, babe? Platforms that you could jump off of, but yeah, no platforms. beachy areas, no nothing acceptable for kids. And that's really frustrating because that was in my Vienna for Kids highlighted section. So. Let me show you what we did. Okay, so we took the train to here, a bridge that's in the middle of the river, and we crossed over to this side, and then figured out that Danube Island is actually this one over here, so then we crossed this bridge, and we kept walking down, trying to find swim spots, couldn't find any swim spots, no swim spots, no swim spots. We get here, and now we're really tired, so we're like, okay, let's just forget this idea, and so we come back, up the ramp to here where we started and began our journey and now we're gonna find lunch because we're all really hungry and grumpy. Am I accurate in saying that Cage? Yes. Yes. <laughs> so you know we told the kids that not everything goes according to plan when we're traveling but we just have to take it in stride and make the best we can out of it. Here we go! Here's our train! now at the Hofburg Palace and its extensive grounds. Just enjoying the shade and enjoying relaxing.
Hamburg Palace um, and its grounds include the Mu Museum of History right behind me and across the street from it is the Museum of Natural History which is that building right there. So we are going to go to the Museum of History. Opera House today on our last day in Vienna. Made of three tons of crystal glass. Yeah. 